What a beautiful day, Brenda. Oh, look at all the birds, Arthur. What's that bird, Arthur? And that one? I don't know. If you'd brought the bird book, we'd know the names of all the birds. So, what have we learnt about this mixed conditional? Well, the if clause uses the past perfect, which means it is the third conditional. And the third conditional refers to an unreal or imaginary past. This past is imaginary or unreal because Arthur did not bring the bird book. And Brenda uses would plus an infinitive verb in the main clause, which is from the second conditional. This is to show a consequence in the present. And that consequence in the present is that Brenda and Arthur do not know the names of all the birds because Arthur did not bring the bird book in the past. Let's look at some more examples when something unreal or imaginary in the past has a consequence in the present. So that's one mixed conditional. If you join me again, I'll talk about another mixed conditional next time.